Hello and welcome back. I am Robot Genie and we are playing the Hansa Ken into Germany. Let's roll because uh, we are mainly waiting for aggressive expansion to go down and, uh, and some opportunity to break Poland's crazy allies. We're getting a lot of people that just that just don't like us. A lot of people don't like us. Oh, we're building a ship here too. Wow, revolts just really just keep on popping up and setting all the time. Did we core it? Yeah, it's, I mean it's cored. But I think that's the one that got uh, that HRE thing from the Emperor. So, it has an extra 10 revolt risk for that. And protect trade and Lubeck. Could probably do to, uh, probably put some trading ships over here soon. Not enough money coming in here to really worry about doing anything. Now what's our technology look like? Um, yeah, it's still five years ahead of time. I feel like I can uh, grab another idea here. Siege going down. We're gonna get an extra merchant, that'll be good. Hmm. Brandenburg's at war with England and Munster. So who are they allied with? They're allied with and Mantua. Where is Mantua? Aren't they like where are, where are they? Just... Oh Mantua is in Italy. That's right. Yep. Uh that's a weird alliance. I don't know. How to attack them. I wouldn't be able to attack them. Uh, I'm not going to be able to do any of those missions. I can't become Papal Controller. Just going to uh, improve relations with a bunch of people. Make people like me some more. That is a good plan. Now I get a I get a lot of enemies. A lot, a lot of enemies. We have made definitely some enemies. View us. Oh no, our enemies are Denmark, Sweden, and Pol and Poland. So Brandenburg's actually not our enemy thought they were. Yeah, we're gonna grab the first innovative idea here. Yeah, so you can see it in Prestige Decay here. With a minus 1%, it changes the decay at 43 to only minus 1.43. That's pretty good. So we already control one cardinal, and uh, we could potentially control a second one. Getting a decent amount of papal influence. I should improve relations with the Pope and we'll gain even a little bit more. For now, might as well do something like that. Uh, I think I'm gonna transfer trade power over here. That should propagate up here. Make it even better for us. Which means that we also should have got more Navy Force Limit. Yep. Five more Navy Force Limit. Building those. Uh, and then, um, 
Yeah. Still, still nothing really to do. We're still waiting on aggressive expansion to drop. That's what we're doing. And people to leave the coalition against us. I mean, Sweden's in the coalition. They only get... It's only uh, minus 23 from aggressive expansion. But they hate us for other reasons. France is about to gain everything that France normally has. And they're probably going to go eat Saveny. Oh, they're killing Portugal. England is uh, not, not doing well. Hmm. The Ottomans have uh, a lot of revolts going on. Looks like they took over Georgia. I would still like the Ottomans as an ally, but they gotta they gotta get rid of one of their rivals first. The best chance for that is Aragon. Or actually, they might get large enough where Venice is no longer a valid rival. <laughs> that could happen. Uh, we're not gonna. Whoa, just a whole bunch of stuff here. Um, no, we're gonna ignore them. Lose 10 prestige. The Republic is sacred. We're gonna lose one stability. Gain 20 Republican tradition. Uh, we're gonna support the Florentine school. Yep. Right, let's boost stability back up. We're having a hard time keeping our admin points. I think these five new ships can go transfer trade in another area. I mean, let's go transfer trade from the Baltic Sea, protect the Baltic Sea. And that way uh, we can get a little bit more trade into, uh, into Lubeck here. Now, can we build any buildings? Yeah. Build some stuff. Build docks. Oh, good. Em Emperor enacted the uh, the first uh, reform. That's good. At least we're doing good getting military tech. You know what, since we're making so much money, why don't I just um, get level 2 advisors? I don't see why not. Uh, well, we can't afford level 3s, so we have no other option there, but we'll go 2 here and then eventually bump up all of them. We can actually afford to do all, all level 2s, so we'll do that. Might as well be making the monarch points. Wow, we are now the people controller. <laughs> that's pretty. That's pretty absurd. That we got people controller. <laughs> France owns three cardinals here, so that's interesting. We're going to go after the second youngest one with the lowest amount of points already invested in him. And privileges with the Pope in an effort to try to keep our uh, our good papal fortunes here. For as long as we're not Protestant, you know. Might as well. We have a lot of diplomats to uh, make people like us, so... It's always good. And we, we kind of need that right now because people don't like us. Well, some people do. Be really nice if uh, 
Brandenburg lost their allies. Who does Saxony hate? Well, they don't like Brandenburg. What are all my relations here? Oh, we're still allied with Oldenburg. Probably get rid of Oldenburg in favor of Saxony. Because Bohemia and Saxony don't dislike each other, but they both don't like Brandenburg. Austria is not ever going to join a fight against them. Well, they're, uh... Well, they're allies, so... Well, we're gaining a lot of inflation here. From events. It's annoying. Drop it a little bit. What do we like, lose some money from trade? No, we're making just as much from trade. I think the inflation just makes all of our costs go up. So we lost a bunch of money. Even though it didn't seem to drop it a lot when we when we paid it down. So I'm not quite sure where the surplus of twenty went from went to. Hmm. Yeah, we're gonna grab this guy. Plus trade efficiency. We're also going to grab. We're not making enough ducats a month to grab another two. Okay, that's fine. We won't do it then. Oh, we can get a military tech. It's uh, it was really cheap. Only 400. Get this military idea, land force limits modifier. We can have another five. We're already like at max manpower, so I think we should do that. So we're gonna do one, two, three, and then two cannons. So that way we'll we'll have ten cannons. Super good. Lots of cannons. Very good. up the national manpower by getting a national manpower modifier guy. That'll work. That'll work. That'll work. And bring these guys over here. Oh, I just want to be Prussia already. I want to be Prussia. Hmm. Poland, Brunswick, and Austria. That is, that is pretty bad. This guy's 58. I think we need to elect him one more time. We're gonna do that. We totally need to not be allied with Muscovy. That would be helpful. I just need them to, you know, die. The Ottomans aren't attacking them because they're not weak. Oh no, we're gaining more inflation, more inflation. We'll get a slight reduction in, in minus inflation costs. So, that'll help. Oh, whoa, we get a lot of... Uh, diplomats that we can use. Uh, yeah, we'll do Austria and then um, let's get Sweden. Kind of like try to uh, in try to get some of these people out of the coalition against us by improving relations with them. Which it does work actually. It doesn't always get them out if you improve relations with them, but if you you know it definitely helps. Mercenary costs down. We're gonna reduce technology costs even further. Oh, 
Always good to have a low tech cost. Hmm. Yep, just slow growth. Welcome to the HRE and the slow growth. It would have been nice if we could have broken free out into here, into the free lands. Or if, or if we could, um, wait, can we? Can we fabricate a claim on the Livonian ore and vassalize them? That, that would be very good. Uh, well, this guy will be returning soon, we'll see. If we could do that, we might just do that. Who are their allies? Who's the Livonian order allied with? Riga and Muscovy. Ah, of course. Of course Muscovy. Wait, <laughs> Muscovy likes us too. Why? Oh, because they don't like Sweden. Oh, that's that's kind of nice. Hmm. Yeah, we're go we're gonna get allied with uh, Muscovy. I'm gonna break my alliance with uh, with Olden Oldenburg here because uh, f him. <laughs> f him. I'd rather be allied to Muscovy. Oh, that's right. I'm not getting another diplomat back if I do this like this. Yeah, well, you know, while they like us, we're gonna do it. I don't want to see Muscovy getting a whole bunch of aggressive expansion against me. We're allying all of our future enemies. Oh, we lost, uh, we lost control of the papacy. Not a huge surprise. I'm surprised we even ever got control of it, to be honest. But we did. That seems to happen more often than, uh, than you think. When you're not making enough points to, that you should ever get control, you kind of do get control. Uh, we'll purge them. We have the manpower for that. We finished our first... Finish offensive it is. Oh yes, yes. So, wow, Poland broke their alliance with Muscovy to attack them, and we're totally gonna join to help. Yeah, totally going to join. Get this tech, and that that's perfect. So now Poland, now we can work on um, splitting up and beating up Poland. Uh, these guys need to come back here because they're not strong enough to go on their own. These guys are fine. Now will Brandenburg join? They did not join. Brandenburg didn't join. Will they let me walk through their land? No, they won't. So that's kind of annoying, actually. But, oh, but I would still have to face Austria. If I attacked Brandenburg, I'd still have to face Austria. Yeah. Oh, what if I attacked Brunswick? Who are they allied with? Nobody would join me against them. Everyone is kind of small. Cleves is small. Leonberg small. Wurzenberg is should be small. They're normally small. Yeah, they're small. So I think maybe fabricate claim on Brunswick, and then uh, during this war we can declare war on Brandenburg and take some one. And it's Denmark. On, yeah, Denmark's in this war on our side, so it's a perfect time to attack. Half the coalition can't attack uh, with them. So, yeah, we're going to use this war fully to our advantage. Uh, Muscovy 
it's going to just destroy Poland, which is, this is all very good, all very good for us. But this looks like the end of the video, so if you're liking this, make sure to like and or subscribe, and join me next time for um, the Muscovy Beats Up Poland War. <laughs> and uh, I'll, I'll see you next time.